the Irish Stairs Handicap Chase will kick off day three. And this is a four and a quarter mark, 0 to 120 handicap. The top one is Compact Bonnie for James Shea. Serge, Stu Gray, ninth edition, Craig Allen, Maritza, Thomas Rogers, Victory Heights, and David Hooley. Opponents Advantage, Darren Thompson, Blue Penny, Martin Lidham, Napa Jiri Raid for David Robertson, Sherry for John Morgan, Blanche Neige, Alex Cherry. Take the long road, Joshua Sutherland, Ring a Rumour Page, Alex Cherry, and Lakota Ghost for Obi Wan. Feeling of event. To face the starter, quite a few long distance races this week. And away they go then. They're making their way down towards the first of the fences, which is a plain one, and they're all safely over the other side. 23 more to take. And John Morgan's Sherry is in the lead, with Surge in second, and then Blanche Neige in third. There's opponent's advantage after that one as they get to the first ditch. And over that one, they will go. Safely to the other side as well with the John Morgan front runner Sherry showing the way by a good four lengths to Stu Gray Surge in the black and the green sash. Right over on the far side with the orange sleeves is Blanche Neige and then opponent's advantage with the maroon with the white sleeves as they get to number three. We'll safely over that one as well with Take the Long Road. Just the back marker, short run to the next. These three coming up pretty quickly and they're all safely over the second one of them. Third as well, so some good jumping from these stairs at the moment as they start to make their way towards the next turn. And Sherry is now up by a good seven to Blanche Neige in second, and then Surge is third. Opponent's advantage is still fourth, but has now dropped back into the pack. Ninth edition is after that one in the green and the yellow hoops of Craig Allen. Maritz is also close up, so to his victory heights take the long road. Has made a significant forward move up the inside of the field. It was last a second ago and is now comfortably sitting in mid division, looking towards the back. Compact Bonnie and Blue Penny, a winner last week. The back marker is John Morgan's horse. Gives that one an almighty wallop, but gets away with it. And continues to lead, but only by about three or four now. To surge in second. Front three remain pretty much the same throughout the race so far. As they get to this ditch, they just stood off it but jumped it well. Most of them all got over it nicely as well. And they're all bowling along quite comfortably. As they get to the next one, slower jump by the leader that time. And the rest of them over it nicely. And the sherry continuing to show the way. Must be quite a few of these. We'll be running in the Grand National later in the season distance races this week this is probably the closest distance wise to the national league but it's sherry who is the leader on surge three lengths down in second then blanche Neige, an opponent's advantage ninth edition is after that one then maritza in the two shades of green the gray is napa pajiri raid with take the long run on its inside in the black and red hoops the purple jacket of victory heights on the outside which tucked in behind that the Yellow for the coat of ghost. And right over on the far rail, blue penny in the maroon with the yellow cap. He's just behind that one, compact body in the green with the red cap. And the back marker is just ring a room of page for Alex Cherry, who's also got the third place horse, Blanche Neige. I think is the only trainer doubly represented in this one. So make their way towards the next. Sherry has had an undisputed lead throughout the race so far. Made a couple of mistakes. Nothing too serious. So you go right down towards the next. And the order changing very little at this stage as they get to it. And over that one they all go. Over it safely with Sherry clear in front still. Surge and Blanche Nez have now just dropped back to the pack, or maybe the pack have caught up with them, whichever way around you want to look at it. Blue Penny was slow at that one towards the back. Well, it stays all day and finally broke her maiden last week after two seasons, but it's Sherry who's in the lead. From Surge second, Blanche Nez third, opponent's advantage fourth, and ninth edition fifth. It's not really changed throughout the race at all so far. As they get over that next one. This 
triple again. Almost like the railway fences at Sander, they're just a little bit further apart, I think. I said, you know, well, that one was a mistake there by Maritza. We're just seeing that one shuffle down the path. That's another one that's been around for a season or two. But Sherry is in the lead. And he's going to now swing right handed and down towards the stand. And there'll be one more circuit of the track. Sherry leads. Leads back up to a good five again now. As Blanche Nish has just about poked his head into second with the opponent's advantage in third now. Surge just dropped back to fourth on the inside, giving a bit of a breather that one. Then take the long road in ninth edition. The grey Nakabajiri raid on the outside is getting a little bit closer as they take that one. Mistake this time was from Victory Heights as Lakota Ghost goes past him in the air. Uh, Ring a rumor page is still the back marker, but probably no more than a dozen or so lengths off the lead. As they continue. run towards the next which is a ditch and over that one they all go all over it safely again one or two being pushed along on the back including blue penny and compact body and over the next a good jump by the leader they really attack the fence and got away from it well take the long road as they moved into second as they come up past the winning post they'll swing right handed shortly and then go out for a complete circuit of the track and this Irish stairs handicap and sherry is in the lead and has been all the way so far. Leads by about two and a half or three lengths to opponent's advantage on the inside of Take the Long Road, then Surge on the inside of Blanche Neige, and then Napa Bajiri Raid on the outside of Ninth Edition. Bit of a gap then back to the rest of them, who are headed by Maritza with Victory Heights on the outside, the yellow jacketed Lakota Ghost on the rail, and the green of Compact Bonnie, the maroon of Blue Penny, and finally the blue and orange. Of Ringaruma Page at the back. Facing down towards the final mile and a quarter now. One or two of these are going to have to start making a move shortly. Sherry's bowling along in front. We know how good John Morgan's front runners are. And this one is doing okay at the moment. With opponent's advantage. Creeping closer in second. Take the long run on the outside. He's also going with him. And Serge is still going well on the rail. Longchenesh just dropped back a little bit as Bajiri Ray joins that leading group. It looks like Compact Bonnie's going to about be about to as well. So some of those at the back are now just starting to creep a little closer. Blue Penny's just been switched to the outside to make a bit of a forward move as well as they come down towards the final mile and they'll take the railway fences one more time. But it's Sherry in the lead from Take the Long Road and Opponent's Advantage. Then Surge over the first one they go. And over that one they're all safely over it. Racing down towards the next and that's a ditch oh, get the railway fence going to throw in a four at the back there ring a rumor page is gone just didn't take off uh, ring a rumor page is out of the race but sherry is in the lead then now from take the long road in second blanche nesh now being pushed up around the outside coming through to challenge for second opponent's advantage is still there surge is still there as well blue penny is creeping into it around the outside as they got over that one and it's still sherry they've got to get to sherry's in the lead over it nicely good jump by blue penny seeing that one jump right up into a challenging position for second as they get over the third of those railways it's sherry in the lead blue penny's gone second ninth edition is third then comes take the long road then surge then blanche nesh an opponent's advantage now but Jimmy Ray's lost its place. The race is on in earnest now. They've got four furlongs to go. And it's Sherry who's in the lead by a length and a half to Blue Penny in second. Ninth edition is third. Gap back to opponent's advantage. Fourth. Then comes Take the Long Road and Surge. Blanche Nez and the Napa Pajiri Road. Compact Bonnie's trying to run on. They've got three more fences to take. And Sherry has been in the lead all the way but he's now being impressed by Blue Penny on the outside. Then comes Ninth edition and opponent's advantage. Over the second last they go. And Sherry's just a bad been headed by Blue Penny. It's Blue Penny and Sherry. The ding dong battle up towards the final couple of flights. There's a couple of fences now, and Blue Penny's taking it up. It's Blue Penny in the lead from Sherry in second. Here comes opponents advantage in ninth edition. Take the long road. He's now coming back through the run on the outside. There's only a further move all the further to go. That was the final ditch, and it's Blue Penny in front. Sherry's battling back on the inside. Opponents advantage on the outside. Take the 
long road is running on and up the final fence. Blue Penny just in front, but now Take the Long Road sweeps into the lead. It's Take the Long Road, Sherry, Blue Penny, three of them in a line, but it's going to be Take the Long Road on the outside that's going to take it. I think Sherry's trying to fight back and up towards the line. It's Take the Long Road that wins it. Sherry second, Blue Penny third, opponents advantage fourth, and all the way back to Maritza. And a battling finish. Take the long one. I think it's just look. Sherry was fighting back. And Blue Penny finally beaten off after that final fence. But it's a win for Joshua Sutherland and Take the Long Road. Let's take a look at the full list. It's a shorthand win for Take the Long Road. For Joshua Sutherland, Sherry for John Morgan was second. Blue Penny for Martinelli was third. Opponent advantage, Darren Thompson fourth. And Compact Bonnie for James Shea was fifth.